Hello and welcome to episode 9 of Teuton Glory. It's been a few days since I've played this and since the videos went out, so let's do a little recap. Well, our ceaseless wars with Poland is currently not happening, <laughs> which is great. And that's mainly due to a war has recently finished and the Ottomans are invading Poland. I am even thinking about starting a war. That's the situation we're currently, currently in, that is with Poland, I mean. Uh, but we'll see. We are somewhat embroiled in the second war of Swedish independence because we were guaranteeing their independence. I didn't really mean to, but um, they're massively outnumbered Denmark, so I, I don't feel like it'll be too long before that's over. I'm hoping I can maybe nick something from the war, but I don't have too much of a fleet to speak of, and Denmark still got by far the biggest fleet in the war. Um, we gained a little bit of territory back after our initial defeats in episode 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, we got Pomerellen Pom Pommer back. Uh, obviously, we've got all the updates now, so there is a few new features that we've only recently been using. Um, obviously, if you're watching this, please don't hesitate to check out my other EU4 playlist, which is Make America Great to start with, and that's with the Huron. And I started in 58 AD, so that could be a rather long series. So, I think we'll unpause it. I don't think there's too much going on for me just now. Let's just check out. Economically, again, fairly decent situation. Um, trade's not superb, but it's not bad either, considering. Um, yeah, everything more or less is okay. What policies can we add? It's rubbish. Um, what about forming Prussia? What would that be? We need higher admin tech, and we need to be reformed or Protestant. That's interesting. Oh, sorry if you can see that. It's Windows 10. Um, okay, let's just have a little look at this. How many... Ah, so Scotland is already reformed. What about Protestant? Would that be worthwhile? I'm not so sure. They've already got a centre for... Oh, now that's interesting. Well, if it spreads, I think I will. I will change. I would like to be Protestant. Um, just use the national tax modifier and then improve relations, really. I've always liked that. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. I think we'll just let it run. Okay, let's get started. Should more or less be able to stay on plus four speed. I think we will keep... Yeah, so let's build up a bit of cash before I start spending anything. Um, is there anything I can really do in this war? I don't think there is, you know. Um, I mean, realistically... Colonialism. Oh, that's a good point. Where are we on this? We have nothing at all. It's not hugely important for us. Of course, we've now got this. Uh, we've converted another nation, supposedly. Must admit to not remembering doing that. But we'll see. Okay. So I hope everyone's enjoying the series. Uh, let me know any feedback as always, any strategies. I've been watching a few other YouTubers trying to get some um, help and tints. Um, I obviously watch a lot of Quill. Uh, I've been watching a, a chap called Kundes. Um, check out his YouTube channel. It's K-H-U-N-D-E-S. He's uh, very amusing and he's very in-depth in his knowledge as well, which I do enjoy. If that's your sort of thing. Saying that, I'm not that in-depth, so maybe if you are watching this, you might not be too much into that sort of thing. But don't hesitate to check it out. And honestly, I think that's the best thing about YouTube. In so many other places in the world, you would never, ever recommend somebody that does the same thing as you. But it's not really a competition on YouTube. I know myself that I'll watch multiple channels that do the same thing just because I enjoy the item, whether it's Total War, Europa Universalis. I just enjoy it, and I, I like that. I think that's a very good thing. I also did a Dark Souls 3 video recently. And that was quite quite interesting. Uh, I'm terrible at those sort of games, and it'd be fair to say there's not probably going to be a Let's Play series on it, as I could barely get past the tutorial. In fact, I'm not sure I got past the tutorial. That was the situation I ended up in, which is, I realise, utterly pathetic. But um, that's the way it is. Oh, I wish I wasn't blockaded all the time here, though. So what is our situation with manpower, land force limit, local modifiers... Okay, okay. Oh yeah, of course. Let's not forget, we have the mighty Sammy as a vassal. 
who have actually occupied the northern regions of Scandinavia and of course we've got Karelia as one of our provinces. Now are we at level 20 on everything? I believe we are now. Level 30, level 31, level 20. Ugh, Poland. Now, what do you think guys? Do you think it would be worthwhile Going to war with Poland. Let's just get this piece sorted. Yeah, we'll have a white piece with Denmark. I'm not really that interested. Um, I mean, they're really losing against. Do you know what? I, I'm going to risk it. Ugh, I just don't have a huge amount of manpower. Let's get this four up. Let's drop this four down. What have we got here? We've got a couple of Caravel, a couple of Caracks. What's this? These are probably Cogs. Yeah. And these are Galleys. Not much in the way of fleet, but let's just get involved. Uh, military access. Yeah, sure. Oh, what do you think, guys? Shall we check? Let's, let's be a little bit sensible for once. Let's check out what sort of army they have. Poland. They have, they have a lot of artillery. But they don't have a lot of manpower. Now, if I was to go to war with them, who would come in? Moldova. I mean, do we care? Not particularly. Livonia join us? No. I'm going to do it. This is a huge risk. Don't care. Going to do it. I don't think they can beat us currently. Let's recruit another 5,000 men. I don't want to do, go over the top with it. Um, got a half decent, half decent general for once. Call for peace, so we've got decent bad war exhaustion. Let's just reduce that. I probably haven't planned this very well. Let's be practical here. Uh, yeah, I'd go for the prestige at the moment. Why is Austria paying the foreign debts of the Mamluks? Very strange. The Ottomans are at war with the Mamluks as well. Interesting. Be strange. Are they at war with the Georgia as well? Oh no, they're. How are they in the same war? They're very strange. Anyway, not got time to look at that. Let's detach the siege force. Let's not waste our time here. Okay. I suppose we may as well. I oh, know we can't go for Warsaw yet. I, I would like to make this a quick war. I just want to gain back my territory, really. And maybe a little bit more. You know how it is. I think I'll get you going there. And you may as well just head up there. Now, if I can make this war quick, even if they come back into this, if I can take enough early on, I feel like I can do this. I'm sure. Oh, yeah. There we go. Get your artillery over here. Come on. We can do this, guys. Oh, God. Oh, God. They've already got a big army. I don't think I want my armies as small as this. So let's just see what they do. Now, if they do attack them, they will be doing a border crossing. Yeah, they're not going to. I think I should probably attack them after I take this. The problem is I always seem to lose battles in this. Probably because I'm rubbish, but um, <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Okay. Well, we definitely want another military advisor. Yeah, let's get the national manpower modifier. Not a bad plan. I am a little bit concerned by manpower. Um, now the question is, can I take these guys out? I think I can. Okay, let's go into here. Oh, now that's interesting. They're marching through my territory. I bet I lose this battle. No, I didn't. Yes! Amazing. I won a battle against the Polish. It's one of my first. Actually, no, 
know, you go there and you go there, because I would imagine the army will go there. So you can stack fight them. That'd be superb. Now, what do I want from this war? Definitely want Colesburg. I would like that, basically. What would be my overextension? It's not too bad, you know. Um, yeah, I mean, I would take all that if possible. We'll see. We might be pushing our luck there. Even a single province would be nice. I, I'd like to take another... Can you not just get in there? Yes, you can. Let's get involved in them straight away. I don't want them to get in all... <sighs> I wish my allies would get involved in this. Please. Oh, no! Oh, it's happened again! <laughs> Where did they get all the soldiers from? That must be like their entire army. Oh, this is so painful. Right. Oh. Okay, what could we do here? We're obviously not going to get this. Why are the autumn Ah yes, come on Ottoman, save me Amazing. I doubt the Ottomans will win that though. Oh my god. They must have superb draft new soldiers. Oh, I don't wanna do that. Um Oh yeah, cost of reducing more exhaustion, not bad. oh wait a minute. No no let, let's not get ideas at the moment. Okay, let's go take Poznan. If we can just deal with all this stuff, that'd be handy. Okay, get in there. I don't want to spread my forces too thin. reality is I need to try and deal with this quite quickly. Yeah, of course you can. Ridiculous thing to ask. Um, you've been my allies for over a century, if I remember rightly, or about a century. Nice. I wonder what they would be willing to give us now, even with just 5% war score. Not a lot. I don't want, I don't want the Ottomans to peace out with them, though. They're pretty much the only thing keeping me in this, in my opinion. Yeah, let's go to Krakow. Um, you go there. Oh, it's already under siege, isn't it? Fuck. I don't think they have any army to speak of, do they? Okay, go take Novi Swats. This has got double meaning for me as well. Mainly. Oh no! Ah, oh, they pieced out. They pieced out. Oh, what would it take? Oh, not much. Not much. Please. You can't have much of an army left. Please. We take that. Should I? Let's just keep going until an army comes towards us. Because I might be able to get a little bit more out of them. But let's just keep an eye on it. Let's not do anything crazy. Okay, that's crazy. Um, Shall we just take it? Oh, fucker. I think I could take that army though, so... Okay, the Siege of Poznan's over. Let's go there. Why can't I get out of here? Let me out! Please! Oh, they would take that though now, wouldn't they? Yeah, I'll go for that. Let's get two provinces. And... Perfect. Nice! Nice! I'm so happy! I'm so, so happy with this. I mean, I could never have done that without the Ottomans. Not really helping me, but 
you know, doing all the work, basically. Are you going to demand it back? No, I'm not giving you. But what I will do is improve relations with you. Oh, I'm so happy, guys. I'm so happy. We're actually doing something. Um, let's get rid of a few of these. Okay, let's disband this guy. Oh, oh I reckon some of you are going to be surprised that I actually managed to do anything. Um, let's put the forts down at least. Bohemia has declared war on Poland. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Serves you right, buggers. Um, and there's some caravels. Okay. Great advisor has died. We don't care. We beat Poland in our war. Do, 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 do. Sorry. It's getting ridiculous now, but... If you've been watching this series, you know how much this means to me. Let's put the maintenance down. I can't. My worry is my manpower, you know. What? Yeah, Pomeranian's not so bad. Could I change the culture of that? Does that be worth it? I think I'd rather get my tech up first. We're not too far away on anything. And Bohemia, now if everyone just keeps eating out of um, Poland, that'll be great for me. I don't think there is much of a threat anymore anyway, realistically. Um, they're certainly not a great power anymore. We're not a million miles away now. This has been superb, guys. Two provinces. Um, what's this? Hear ye, hear ye. Let loose Pantalon, Harlequin, and all the other stock characters of the traditional comedy de l'art on your unsuspecting population and watch as they are entertained by the antics and the shenanigans. A good piece of comedy can make anyone forget for a while. And the heroics of... Okay. It's insinuating that I'm tyrannical. I'll take it. <laughs> Yeah, let's just maintain with Austria for a wee while. Can I offer you anything, Austria? Can I send you a gift, maybe? Just a cheeky wee gift? There you go. Just because we're pals, you know? And am I still allied? I'm allied with Sweden. Munst I'm allied with Munster. Oh, that's right. Munster's pretty powerful, you know? It's a bit strange, but sure. Oh, what's going on in Livonia? Do I want to help them? I'm not sure I do. I'm not sure. Oh, God, I've got no manpower. I'm sorry, Livonia. Centuries of friendship mean nothing to me. We have three active cardinals. And we've still never been the papal controller. We do want to change to Prussia. Absolutely. Which might seem strange. But I want to be Prussia. I can't remember the ideas, but knowing Prussian history... I can only imagine Prussian ideas are militaristic. And that is what we... I mean, I've never really spent spell out the end goal. I'd love to have a wee colony somewhere. We'll see if we ever get to that stage. But um, the end goal for me is to be a central European power. Basically to make Germany, I suppose. Although I don't think I want to make Germany. I want to stay as Prussia, I think. Um, well, what do we want here? Yeah, that's fine. Wolfgang, what a brilliant name. Looks like the Portuguese and the Spanish are settling. What is this? Oh, it's a local tribe. Bold fighter, great Wolfgang. Spanish. The Norwegians have got rebels. I'm alright with that. England has now taken... Oh no! Amazing, amazing. Scotland still exists. We'll subsidise you eventually, Scotland, when we ever have any money. Oh, look at Poland. It's just been wiped off the map. Ha uh ha. -huh. Perfect. We can now make that a state as well. Strop. Yeah, let's make it a core. I don't really like using that. What edicts do we have? Uh, I don't think we'll bother with anything just now. My manpower is pretty good. Why is that? Nobility, recruit peasants. Recruit peasants? Is that one of my national ideas or something? I never really looked at this because, oh yeah, you see, you know my my women ideas are actually pretty good as well, aren't they? 
exactly. Am I anywhere near getting colonialism yet? Why can't I get colonialism? Oh, it's present. So... Am I just been an idiot? Oh no, okay. So now it's expanding. I certainly can't afford that. Although, I'm not poor. I must admit. Let's uh, down the army maintenance more. Let's just put it all the way down. We're slowly building manpower. I don't think we're fully recruited yet, but we're only 400 off, which isn't really a lot. So it'd be great to start getting some comments on this, guys, if you're interested in where we're going to go. I feel like we're probably past the stage where we're only going to be invaded by Poland all the time. Uh, there is some significant powers forming here, to be fair. Um, Bohemia, Lithuania, the Ottomans are... Yeah, the Ottomans are the Ottomans. Um... <laughs> Uh, Muscovy, I presume it's going to be Russia soon. Livonian Order are no joke. The powerful Sami are still around, which is great. Unhappiness among the clergy. Uh, I'll go for the papal influence. I feel at one point I'm going to have to be the papal controller. I'd love to do my technology. Where are these guys on technology? I realise I've been a complete idiot and not realising where they the other country's technology was. I'm a bit behind. There we go. Musket. Can now build weapons manufacturing. Superb. Do I have anywhere I can build a weapons manufacturing? Probably not. Uh, copper, iron or oil. Where trade goods? No. Naval manufacturers. A lot of naval manufacturers. Um, yeah, that's fine. Sure. I don't want to change the culture and provinces yet. I really don't like the way that looks. It always looks like it's in Polish territory. The enemy territory, we should say. Do you guys still... Why do you want to be so... Oh, it's just enforced religion. Oh, that's right. That's why I can do this. So this episode's actually going pretty well so far. Oh. Come on. Yeah, for Novo. Oh, he's pretty decent. Wolfgang. Trade efficiency, plus 10%. I'm playing on my own time, uh, Venice. And it'd be fair to say that I'm getting beaten a little bit by the Ottomans, but I'm so rich. I'm only 30 years into it, and I'm making about 45 gold a turn, which is a beautiful thing. Just doing the standard grand campaign, nothing too crazy. Um, okay, I feel like we can probably... Hmm. Do we want to build anything like that in these places? Not until I've changed them. Is that worth it? I don't think it is worth it. We'll do this though. At land force limit. Oh, bugger, I could have embraced there. Could I cancel that? Did that get me back? Is it worth embracing this? I mean, how far away are these? Well, let's wait a little bit longer. Yeah, it's gone up pretty quickly. It seemed like a waste of money, wouldn't it? So how come that one's not coloured? Is it only over 50%? So what's that about? Why is that half green? Can somebody explain that to me if anyone gets here? I don't understand why that one isn't... Um... Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Sorry, I'm just jibber-jabbering. Okay, I can see most of the world already. It's a bit ridiculous. I've not even got out of the Baltic Sea yet. Um, okay, fantastic. The scythe. I'm a bit behind. So, we should get that next turn. I don't really want to um, spend that much money, but the current technology penalty is massive. Okay, let's wait until we get these two then, and then we'll call it there. We'll probably call the episode there, I mean, the embrace. Let's make sure we embrace first. Come on, let's get it going. And what other technology am I actually waiting for here? Diplomatic. And that will upgrade my ships, which is probably needed for me. Okay. Still don't understand what's going on here. I mean, I do have quite a lot of money, so I may as well embrace it before these two are ready. Let's just get these two done. 
Still don't have full army there. Oh, I need to have a small amount of army maintenance. Oops. Wait, what was that? Oh, why did I press that button? Somebody's supporting Sammy's independence. God damn it. Why would they want to be independent from the glorious Teutonic Order? We beat the Polish! Or, I don't know what war that was. Maybe the seventh time of asking. The one time... Wait a minute. Ah, <laughs> the Sami got territory from that war. Amazing. Amazing. Sweet. My vassals are growing powerful. Maybe that should concern me. Probably not. <laughs> okay, we almost there yet? No, 89%. Yeah, we'll increase it after this one. This one's going up slowly, isn't it? Why is that? Yeah. Rebel Uprising, Pomeranian Separatists? I don't think so. You can sit and stop anyway. I do believe it does do something, doesn't it, when you... Yeah. I will change your culture at some point when I can. Although I don't think I can do that yet. I've got a decent, decent load of money here, don't I? Oh, come on. Accept the demand. Yeah, take the diplo here. His Holiness the Pope has tasked... Uh, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Papal Inf Oh, 25. Come on. Just gonna keep being the Pope over and over, get over again. How dare the Papal State control the Papal States? Oh, is that Great Britain now? Boo, boo. Free Scotland. Scotland's... <laughs> I'm going to have to do something. If I, if I get to the stage where I'm powerful enough, I'm going to have to see what I can do for Scotland. I hope there's something. Embrace the Counter-Reformation. I don't really want to, because I do want to become Prussian. So, no, I will not embrace the Counter-Reformation. Reformation? Reformation? Not sure. Um, see, if I was to embrace that with none of my provinces... <laughs> yeah, Let, let's not get carried away. Let's wait. Is that President? And that's President. Well, yeah, let, let's wait until... Something happens. Oh, come on. Could have just rounded it up for me there. Right, let's embrace this. Okay, we've embraced it. What's the next one, anyway? How do I see the next one? Print impress? Oh, God, it's not far away, is it? And we've got technology upgrade. Superb. Okay, so we can upgrade our galleys. Which will be nice. And we can upgrade our cogs. Let's do our cogs first. And yeah, we can afford that as well. What is our sort of level here? A few more ships, yeah, it's probably worthwhile. Um our land force limits 35, our manpower's building up nicely. We're in a good condition here. Okay, so I think we're gonna call it there. I think that was a really good episode for me. Uh, again, I'm never too sure how exciting these are to watch. I love all this stuff, I love watching other people do this, but let me know if you want me to do anything differently. Uh, I'm quite pleased with that. Gave their provinces back. We're getting close to 300 development, uh, which doesn't put us a million miles away from Austria. And I can feel some actions being taken soon. I think it'd be fair to say that we're going to fight Poland again. Uh, we, we owe Poland a little bit. Um, let's just leave it at that. Oh, you know what? Next episode. Next episode, guys. It might be another war with Poland. If I was to go to war with Poland, what would be the situation? Wurzburg. Uh, I think we can deal with that. I wonder if I am owed any favours. I better do this whilst you're on, because I might not remember. Why would you not join the war with me? Is it just because I don't have a decent reason? I feel like that's not a bad reason. Ah, it's in debt. Right, well, if we remember that, maybe we can do a little bit to help them in debt. We could pay off Sweden's debt for sure. Should we just do that now? Uh, how'd you do that again? 
Can you pay off debt? You must be able to, because I see it all the time. I've only ever seen it on vassals. Right, I'll have to look that up. Um, but I think we will probably do that. And then I want Luba's, Notech, Plock, Wizna, and... No, that's probably all, just those four. Um, and then we'll start becoming a power. Okay, well, thank you very much. I will save it, as always, whilst you're still watching. Um, we're getting some decent views on this series. Um, hopefully people will continue watching it, because I, I will continue this one, even if I end up with only one viewer. Uh, I want to play this one all the way to the end. So, as always, if you like, please press on the like button and subscribe, and leave a comment if you so wish. I'll see you soon. Thank you and goodbye.